Dr. Shangula says a majority of the people who are currently hospitalized have not been vaccinated and most of the deaths reported in the past three weeks are of those who have not been inoculated. He is also concerned about people not completing their vaccination doses. I wish to add that of concern is the fact that the number of people being vaccinated with the first dose in Namibia are less than those of persons who are coming for the second dose. It is important to note that persons who have received the first dose have built up immunity against COVID-19 and are therefore afforded a level of protection. Those who are not vaccinated are the most at risk of severe illness and death. There have been allegations in social media that people who are dying are those who have been vaccinated. There is no shred of evidence that supports this narrative. On the contrary, statistics confirm that those who have died are not vaccinated. Namibia, he says, has enough vaccines procured by the government in addition to those received through donations. At present, Namibia has sufficient doses of the vaccines for the vaccination campaign. We therefore urge our people to get vaccinated. There is a false information being circulated alleging that Namibia has received expired vaccines. I want to debunk these lies and state categorically here that there is absolutely no truth in such allegations. The nation must remain assured that all the vaccines delivered to Namibia, whether through donations or those that we have procured with government resources, are within their shelf life and are safe for use. The public is warned against spreading false information about COVID-19, adding that doing such is punishable by the law. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.